Hey, this is Jeff Hazel. I'm live right here from Social Week, opening night reception where it's wild and crazy, and I'm meeting the most interesting people. This happens to be my newest partner. And Eric, most interesting person that and, you're meeting. And most in, well, one of them. They're all so doggone interesting. But right now, this moment, she's the most interesting. Erin Saxton, who used to be the CEO of the Idea Network, and now you're the CEO of... Tallgrass Public Relations. Which is great, which is, yeah. which is a, a combination of a company that I own and, a, and your company. And tell the people a little bit about you, I mean, because you've got so many things. You work with, you know, Barbara Walters, all these different people. So talk to them a little bit about these. Well, I'm a TV producer, a bunch of Emmy nominations, but we don't have to focus on that. Whatever. Um, and we decided to merge companies because we're stronger together than we were apart. And I just have a lot of national TV experience, and I owned the ID Network for 12 years, and now you and I are part of the same family. Which is awesome. So now you're working what? With authors, thought leaders, tech companies? Anybody who wants to build a platform. So whether you want to be in tech or B2B or B2C, it doesn't matter. Um, we want to build your platform. We want to make you famous. Well, so let's talk about that. So how do you guys use social media? you got, you know, six, seven, eight, ten people, and they're all working. They're monitoring stuff. How are they using social media for the clients, like a thought leader or an author? Well, we, we really want to monitor social media. Like, traditional PR just isn't really going to work anymore. Um, and yet, digital and social media isn't always as effective. So we try to come up with a hybrid, very customized approach. So we really look at everybody's campaign to see, like, what they need for social media traditional, whether it's national or, like, more retweeting or pearls or anything. It doesn't matter, but everybody gets a customized campaign. Which is really awesome to be able to do that and have that interaction with people. What, do you, what would you give to people that are out there that want to be a thought leader. I mean, there's a lot of people that are trying to be thought leaders, and which is have to be very genuine, have to have a lot of you know thought behind it. But yeah. <laughs> but what would you tell them that in terms of a tool or a, a hint that they could use about social media? Well, I think you know, like just a lot of people just like come out of the woodwork when they think they have a book or when they think, but they don't stay there. I want people to stay there. I want them to blog. I want them to tweet. I want them to keep having a following, even if they don't have anything major to say. Like, everybody writes a book and then disappears for a few years, writes a book and comes back. I want them to stay. Like, you stay out there. And I and I think that's important. So I think there's no better place than using social media for something like that. So not the seesaw or yo-yo yeah, kind of approach. Which is really I want you to get on the highway and put it on cruise control and keep driving. And then when you write your book, drive a little faster. But social media allows you to maintain that constant pace. I think it's just so important to use social media that way. You know, I got to agree with you because I was in the public relations before I got into marketing. Right. And, you know, the media like that. You know, don't just, you know, come see me every time you want to. Be right. there when we need you to exactly. be. Exactly. Which is, I think is great. So. Yeah, I mean, and media's always going to do their due diligence about you. And if they see, like, you have, like, these peaks, they're going to just think that you're needing them or using them. And media has feelings, too. <laughs> well, that's hard to believe. But we'll leave it with that. And we'll see how we react to that a little bit later on. That's going to, oh, that, I'm going to get a tweet about that. Yeah. This has been Jeff Hazel and Aaron Saxton. Aaron his publicist, he did not mean that. We love <laughs> well, it. Maybe a little bit because that's the way I roll. All right, thanks a lot. We'll see you later.